There's a new approach to tackling some of the social problems affecting Britain's towns and cities. Arts organisations hope a radically different version of Shakespeare's Othello will educate youngsters around the issues of race and identity. Well, they have mixed traditional Elizabethan language with modern street and hip-hop slang. Sky's arts and entertainment correspondent Lucy Cotter reports. This is Othello remixed. The clue is in the title. Hold your hands! Remember your cue to fight? You would have known it by the bell. It's Shakespeare's 400-year-old play set in inner-city London. They've thrown in hip-hop and blended Elizabethan with modern slang. What is a boy? These were my only toys. We're always remixing language. We're all, language is constantly evolving. You know, if, if Chaucer would have been shown a Shakespeare text, he would have been horrified at the bastardization of the English language, right? So I think what we're doing now, especially what young people are doing with the English language, is being very creative. What are you saying? I'm saying that you drugged her, abused her and enchanted her with spells and voodoo. I love Shakespeare and coming here just confirmed for me the reasons why I love it. Because I would say, oh, that word sounds nice or oh, that sounds like a really deep phrase. To be or not to be, it can be translated to however you would phrase it in the modern day. Like, oh, this life is long, man. It just helps go back to the root of what Shakespeare started. He did it in his own, like, old English slang, and we're doing it in our new English slang. The all-black cast is professional, but the majority are alumni of the Intermission Youth Theatre, which uses drama to engage young people from vulnerable backgrounds, youth offender institutions and inner-city communities. I came here when I was about 16, 17. And um, I think it saved me just from everything that I was going through as a teenager. They are all but stomachs and we are all but food. Unfortunately, if you don't have something positive to get into with kids, it ends up leading you to get into something that's not positive. This particular project, year after year after year, it actually is transforming um, youth's lives. This updated version of Othello has been adapted and directed by ex-offender Darren Raymond, who rediscovered Shakespeare while in prison. I made some choices that were detrimental to, you know, to my life. And then I found the arts, and I was able to kind of understand a lot more about myself, about my choices, because I was allowed to step into the shoes of, of other people and understand maybe how my actions can affect other people. <laughs> This production pulls no punches, taking on Shakespeare's themes of race, isolation and identity, both in and outside the ring. Lucy Cotter, Sky News.